Hello and welcome to Daily Wellness. My name's Emily and I'm going to get started lying on my back, um, hugging my knees into my chest. And I invite you to do the same. And close your eyes and get comfortable as we settle in. And feel the earth supporting your body. Pay attention to the sound of your breathing and the points of contact between your body and the ground below you. And in grabbing both knees, you can inhale knees over hips so your arms are long. And as you exhale, squeeze your knees in towards your chest. And inhale, feel this wave ripple up your spine as you bring knees over hips again. And exhale, hugging knees into your heart. And inhale, bringing knees over hips, feeling the gentle arch in your low back. And exhale, squeezing knees into your chest again, noticing how it changes the shape of your back on the earth. And continue at your own pace, breathing in knees over hips and breathing out, hugging knees into heart. We can let our feet touch the ground as we let go of our knees on our next inhale. I'm going to um, lift my legs up so my toes are reaching for the sky. And I'm going to inhale my toes towards me. And exhale, gently lower my legs, hovering over the ground. Inhale, both feet up. I can flex and point my toes. Maybe flex so that my um, soles of my feet are pointing towards the sky, palms on the earth. And exhale as I point my toes, bringing my legs almost to the ground. And then inhale, both legs up, toes pointing towards my face. And exhale, lowering legs almost to the ground. And one more time, inhaling both legs up. And exhale, as I slowly lower down, hovering legs above the ground as I just flutter them back and forth, crisscrossing both legs. I can bring my um, hands to support my head. So I feel the sensations created by this movement, the warmth it creates. As I flutter and hover for just a few more seconds, just a few more breaths here. For five, four, three, two, and one. And just relax my legs, letting them flop open and let my arms relax beside my body, palms up. You can notice my breath, notice my heartbeat. Close my eyes, relax my face. Roll my shoulders down the back. And then using my hands, I'm just gonna gently create a little traction, create more space between my head and my shoulders. And do that a couple more times, using my hands to Gently massage the back of my neck and gently lift my head, lifting it up off the ground and then placing it back down. And you can gently move my head side to side, inhaling and exhaling, enjoying the benefits of the effort that I just put in. And then I'm going to plant my soles of my feet into the earth and inhale my hips up <clears throat> as I walk my hands under them and just breathe here feeling my shoulder blades press into the earth feeling steady And then gently lower down. And because that was such an effectively warming practice, 
gonna take off what I don't need anymore. And then come into, uh, lie on my back again with my soles and my feet on the earth. And I'm gonna bring my palms by my shoulders so that my, my fingertips are pointing towards my feet. And then I'm gonna inhale, up and lift my hips. Come to stand on the top of my head. Make any adjustment to my hands that I need, moving them a little bit further away. And then inhale, pressing up to stand on legs and on hands, on feet and hands. And breathe here. And choose to have eyes open or eyes closed. And neck neutral. One more breath here, and I'm gonna gently lower down. I come to hug my knees into my chest again as I squeeze and rock back and forth. And I'm gonna kick my light, left leg out long as I hug my right knee in towards my shoulder. And then sweep that right knee over to the left side of my body, keeping um, left hand and right knee as right arm falls out to the side, right palm face up, I'm going to turn and gaze at right hand and maybe close my eyes. And inhale, I feel the breath move through my body and exhale, I melt a little deeper into the earth. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. And then coming through center again, I'm going to give another big squeeze, bringing my uh, face up towards my knees. And then I'm going to kick my right leg out, hugging left knee in towards left armpit. And bringing right hand to the outside of left knee, I'm going to sweep that knee to the earth on the right side of my body. Left arm comes out to left side, palm up. As I turn my head to gaze to the left, eyes can be closed. I'm going to inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. And exhale. And I'm going to gently rock back and forth on my back. Eventually coming to a comfortable seat, or rather a comfortable squat. With palms at heart center, I'm gonna press my elbows to the inside of my knees, feet to the side, wider than my hips. I'm gonna take a moment here to set an intention for this moment. And I invite you to do the same and to remember to set an intention for any moment in your life throughout the day. Any moment that you might feel that you need it, a little troubled, a little lost, a little frustrated. And then pressing palms into the earth, I'm going to come to a forward fold, bringing my feet together, letting everything go. Knees can be bent a lot or a little. Head hangs heavy. You can shake it out, yes. Shake it out, no. And I'm gonna gently roll up, coming to stand, rolling shoulders down my back, shining my palms forward, fingers reaching to the ground. And then taking a wide-legged stance here, I'm going to come to um, kind of squat in a, in a big stance here, kind of goddess style. I'm going to bring my arms into a cactus position, so palms facing forward, arms about a 90 degree angle, and toes can be pointed out to a point that's comfortable for you. 
You can take a breath here and then let it out with a reliance exhale with your, your tongue out if you want. I invite you. <laughs> so you can do it with me if you want. So I'm going to inhale and then let it go. And one more time, inhaling. You can stand up a little as you inhale. And then exhale, squatting down low, letting everything out, sticking out your tongue. You can make a sound if you want. And then coming to stand up, I'm going to pivot so that my left toes are pointing forward and right toes are pointing about a 45 degree angle out. I'm going to inhale both arms up and then exhale, bring the palms onto my left thigh as I bow forward. Neck neutral, allowing space to breathe. And then exhale, bringing um, my fingertips to the ground. I'm going to let my head go. And then pivoting once again so that I am turning um, to point my right toes forward and left toes at a comfortable angle. I'm going to inhale both arms up and exhale, placing palms on right thigh. I'm going to Gently bow into that heart parallel with the earth, neck neutral. Gaze at the, the floor ahead of my right toes. I'm going to inhale and exhale. Inhale, lengthening from crown to tail. And then exhale, I'm going to release, bowing over that front leg, fingertips to the earth. Head hangs heavy. And then returning to a squat position. I'm going to reconnect with my breath. Just noticing it. We only get so many, so make it count. And then I'm gonna come to just a comfortable seated position and share with you a couple of cat themed haikus. From a haiku menagerie. There's nothing he doesn't know. The cat on the stove. And out from the darkness, back into the darkness, affairs of the cat. So thank you for joining me for daily wellness. To be honest, I don't get to it every day, but that's why it's a practice, not a perfect. It's an invitation. It's a place to direct my attention so that I can do it more than I ever did before. So in the name of your practice of whatever you want more of in your life, I wish you much success. Namaste.